Howdy guys, it's Nintendo Capri Sun, and we are back with more Link's Awakening. So let's equip our Pegasus boots, our anti-gravity boots, and get in here. Don't be getting hit by no bubbles. I really want to get back to that camera shop. I think I'm going to try and make that point to do that in this episode. I haven't looked at the walkthrough or anything for this episode, so I'm kind of just going to be wandering around aimlessly for the most part. 50 rupees, alright. I thought that was going to be a piece of heart for some reason, but it's not. Unless there's, like, somewhere you can bomb a wall in here. No. So let me see. Okay, the Photoshop is actually, like, north of here. So if I can find a way to get up there... Oh, sorry. I hit the microphone there. My tooth hit the microphone. No. It's one of my famous quotes from one of my tapes. Sorry, my tooth hit the microphone there. I've been listening to my tapes as I go to sleep every day. Like, from 1992 and 1993, just putting them on, and I fall asleep to them, to the sound of my own voice, because I pretty much bore myself that much. Whoa. So I haven't been up here too much, but, yeah. Whoa, get out of my way. Wait a second, I think it was actually north of here is where I needed to go. See if we can make it here without looking at the map. And I know I'm finding my way around this world a little better. Here's the camera shop. Or not the camera shop, but the camera place. And this guy just loves to take pictures, so I'll let him take my picture. Go to the back of the room and stand in front of the screen. Let's do that. Something about pictures, I've always been obsessed with them. Here stands a brave man. There's something about being able to capture a moment in time, you know... Like, even though it's just a visual, there's still something that you associate with it, like... I don't know. So you can take a look at your album here. The Travels of Link. Do you want to look at your album? Yeah, let's look. So we got like 12 pictures here that you can find throughout the world by just walking on certain spots. And here's the first one. <laughs> Pretty cool. Kind of like Ness putting up the peace sign saying Fuzzy Pickles and all that. Anyway, is there a quicker way back here? There's a lot of stuff up here I haven't explored yet. Well, at least we filled in those empty spots on the map now. Because I had like three empty spots there. Let me see if I can find... Yeah, I think I just want to go down south here. And oops. Well, let's not get ourselves killed in the meantime, you know. I really wouldn't want that to happen. You know what? I think I might actually, since I have so many rupees, I might as well get this. Hi there, big guy. I'm Crazy Tracy. You've got a secret. I know, I know. How about it? 42? You're charging 42 again? I'll take it. Oh, you know what? That's pre Ugh, You know what? Did you hear how that came out? Jeez. When you lose all heart? Okay. It's probably like... Here's some bonus treatment. Behold, your hearts are full. Cool, thanks. I think it's based on how many hearts you have. That's how much she charges for it. Like... I think it would be six rupees per heart or something. Let's see if I can find my way back out of here again. Whoa. Zombie City. Yeah, here we go. Thank goodness there was this little path here, otherwise I might not have been able to find my way back. Yeah, so like I said, I didn't read the walkthrough, so I'm not really sure what I'm doing now. I'm just gonna... Oh, I haven't bombed this out yet? Damn. Guess we'll do that now. Okay. Up the stairs we go. I want to try to get to that animal village, because I do know I have to go there pretty soon. I don't know if I have to do that now, but I'm going to go ahead and do it now. Well, I think I might need to go north here, actually. Yeah. Still kind of learning my way around this world, but it's getting familiar now, more so to me. Excuse me, Garias. Sorry to interrupt, but, uh, oops. Still going the wrong way here. Eh, may maybe I'm not. Let me see. No, this just goes to the castle, doesn't it? Because that goes up to the bridge right there? Yeah. Okay, I'm officially lost. No, we need to go down here and then go east. Okay, now I got it, I got it. You see, Animal Village. Whoa, hey, hang on a second. Huh. Oh, wow. Okay, uh... Maybe this is how you get across that river, huh? Okay, 
Okay, that would make sense. Seems like you can just jump across, though, couldn't you? Uh, maybe not. I don't know. Whoa! Excuse me. It's two episodes in a row I've done that now. Pull that stunt. Oh, wow. This is kind of pretty. Butterflies, grass. Welcome to the animal village. First, I want to go south. Oh, I see. We got... Oh, oh. No, I can't resist picking up a rock when I see one now after no... Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, well, I just, yeah, that might teach me a lesson there. Wow, I haven't been down here yet. Oh, what is all this? I think we're back over by, like, Martha's Bay or something. Oh, another another bridge here. Oh, jeez, man, I don't know what I'm doing. Secrets are like water when it comes to bridges. Uh, what? That's interesting. Huh. Okay, um, <laughs> Secrets are like water when it comes to bridges. That's rather cryptic. I think I could probably make sense of that in a few... Oh, oh. Man, you guys have got to stop that sneaking out from under the rocks like that. You know, if you're living under a rock, that's fine, but I don't want to... Oh my god! Oh. Take me to Animal Village. Get me out of here. Ah, oh, it's on such a nice day. We need a song from Marin. Hey, wait a second. I got a song from Marin. Let's see if he responds to it. I don't know. No, I guess you probably, like, literally need a song from her. You know, not my version of it, not my cover of it. Hi. You're on a desert. There's a way to get there to the south, but you might not be able to get through if that lazy walrus is in the way. Oh, walrus. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Hmm. Oh, hi. Yeah, I am Skul Donovich. The mermaid statue by the bay is my masterpiece. To tell you the truth, this work is not complete. The art is difficult for you to grasp, is it not? I don't know. Go away! Oh, what's the matter? Maybe I should play the song for you. Wouldn't that be funny if that's what I had to do? <laughs> oh, hello. You don't know the proper etiquette when dealing with a lady, do you? You should have brought flowers or something. Then I might be more inclined to talk with you. Oh yes, in my case, hibiscus are best. Okay. Well, you guys got a funny little village here. Hey, did you know Animal Village and Maybe Village are sister cities? Yes, even though they aren't large enough to be called cities. Anyway, I heard from a very good source that they have a dream shrine in Maybe and that it has something good inside. Is that true? Yeah, it is. I've been there. And I've gotten the thing that was good that was inside. Oh, wow. Nice pink roof. <laughs> yeah, she's fine. Uh, but, oh, hello. Wow, he's got a pineapple there. Hi-ho, hey you. Is that possibly a beehive you have? I just ran out. Well, you swapped it for a pine. You just ran out of beehives? Well, I can see how that would be a problem. It's not as sweet, but it is delicious. I know that tub of goo is asleep right in the way to Yarna Desert. Once he's asleep, he won't budge for a long time. But hey, take little Marin and wake him up with her song. That slob would wake up with a jump if he heard her sing, for sure. Okay, something tells me that's... I don't know. So we got a fat walrus who's in love with a little girl, and he won't move unless we bring her to him. That's kind of sick. But okay. Let me see, something tells me there's a seashell here. No. Well, let me just make sure. Because you never can be too sure. Oh, uh, yeah. Alright. Just checking, just checking. Entrance to Yarna Desert to the right. There he is. Holy cow. Oh, he's dreaming of a girl. He's dreaming of Marin. All I can say is, uh, dream on, buddy. <laughs> goo goo ga choo. Looks like I can walk right there, on that water. Did I not come this way earlier? Well, anyway, long story short, we need to bring Marin back here. So, I'm gonna have to go get her from the village. And it might take a while. Ooh. We have some tricky jumps here. I wanna try this. 
Oh, well, it's not like that, dude. You're crazy. Get out of here. Get out of my way. Thank you. Oh, jeez, I'm being stupid. Can I just push this out? Yeah, there we go. Well, isn't this like... I don't know. This looks just like that other cave. I don't know. Oh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> Can't do that. Oh, well, it was worth a shot. Okay, so I guess in the next episode, I don't know, I might just meet you back where Marin is, because you know where that is, right? So... I guess there wouldn't be anything wrong with that, even though it doesn't take that long to get there. It's still... It would just be good form to... go back there off-screen rather than mess... Oh, yeah, I can walk on that water, because there's a warp there, and that would actually take me back pretty close to where she is. I don't know if you can take her through the warp. But I guess we'll have to find out about that next time. Uh, let's play Link's Awakening, so I'll see you later. Bye.